Good morning dear children I hope you all have revised the Indian and international number system and their place values Today we will revise the chapter and discuss about the pattern to be followed in exams Kindly follow the same pattern and practice the questions again and again Firstly we will differentiate between the Indian number system and the international number system So students you should have the knowledge of both the number system For example, if you want to buy a house and the price of the house is quoted in million, then you must be knowing the international number system for that. So basically, both the number system are exactly same till ten thousand place, but then the Indian number system changes its name after every two digits, and the international number system changes its place after every three digits. Students, we all know that. In the Indian number system, after ten thousand, we get the names such as lakhs and crores. Whereas in the international number system, we get the names such as hundred thousand and millions. As the Indian number system is changing its name after every two digits, it will even get its commas after two digits. And in the international number system, commas are placed after every Three digits. Now we are here with an example of Indian and international number system. In this question, we have to write the number name in the Indian and international system and put the commas. So, firstly, we will start with Indian number system. In the Indian number system, the answer will be fifty-seven crores. Thirty-six lakhs ninety-two thousand five hundred and eighty-three, and according to the international number system, the answer will be five hundred seventy-three million six hundred ninety-two thousand five hundred and eighty-three. So, in the next question, we have to write the numerals and put the commas. Students, we know that if the question will be in the form of crore, lakh. It will be done according to the Indian number system, and if it will be in the form of million, then we have to do it according to the international number system. Students, now we will discuss about the place value. Do you know what is a place value? A place value is the value when we multiply the digit with the place where it is located. So, in this question, we will find the place value. Of all the digits, starting from the eight, the place value of eight will be eight multiplied by one, as it is in one's place. So the place value of two will be twenty, as we multiply the two with the ten. Now the place value of six will be six hundred. Similarly, the place value of the fourth will be four multiplied by thousand, that is four thousand, and the place value of seven will be seventy thousand. So now children you will find the place value of the underlined digit as explained earlier Students keep practicing thank you